Good evening folks, uh, it's James here with wavestreaming.com. It's actually a Sunday night and I've popped into the office just to do a bit of late night work and I thought I'd just get the camera out and give you a couple of uh, tips to maximise your potential audience to your radio station. Now if you're a wavestreaming customer all this is made very very easily via the kind of resources we've got in our control panel. Basically what I want to say is the amount of radio stations that I see online that really don't take full potential of their kind of audience take advantage of the whole potential of their audience is what I'm trying to say. Uh, there's lots of radio stations which should only use the standard shoutcast listen.pls link. Now this basically means only people using Winamp can listen and sometimes iTunes as well. Now there's four links you need on your website um, as I said if you're a wavestreaming.com customer you get given all of these in your control panel. Let me just run through these. So first of all as I just mentioned .pls um, which is for Winamp and also iTunes then there's .asx, which is for Windows Media Player. Think how many people have got Windows Media Player. Absolutely millions. Everyone with a Windows computer has got it installed by default. Then we're moving on to .ram, which is for Real Player. Again, maybe not so uh, not so popular, but lots of people use Real Player. And then there's a brilliant one, which is .m3u, which is basically a universal link. It will work with all of the players I've just mentioned, and it will also work with lots of other media players as well, such as VLC. XMMS, Music Match, and all sorts of open source projects and smaller kind of media players that some people will be using but everyone may not have heard of. So those are the four links you need on your website to kind of take advantage of all the people who may try to listen in and make sure that they can listen in. Um, and if you make it easy for people to listen in, the chances are your listeners will, you know, your listener level levels will rise. Another thing I want to mention is the Flash Player. Now, if you're a wave streaming customer, we provide free Flash players with all Shoutcast accounts. Everyone, absolutely everybody nearly, has got a Flash player installed um, on their web browser. YouTube video, if you're watching this on YouTube, you'll have Flash player. All right? So, if you're a wavestreaming.com customer, make sure you take advantage of the Flash player we provide. Get it on your website, because as I say, it will really absolutely rapidly expand your listener base, because you'll be able to get so many people listening just by a click of a button without needing to open any media players or tune in just so easy for, for people to listen using the flash player. So there we go, a couple of things, a bit of food for thought for you. Um, it's really, really worth you making it as absolutely easy as possible for your listeners to tune into your station. Um, and that's pretty much it. Hopefully I'll have some more quick tips for you very, very soon. Bye for now.